Treasure State has plenty of cattle ranches, but there's only one where you can find a herd of yaks. MTN's Jordan Johnson reports from Kalispell. We have elk in the backyard and bears around everywhere and sometimes moose, gobs of badgers. But the wildlife is not the only kind of creature on Springbrook Yak Ranch. Yes, you heard that correct. 48 hairy and large mammals, usually found in Tibet, can be found here near Kalispell. Thanks to their lung capacity, they can handle more than Montana winters. But it's just natural for yaks. They fit right in. Jim Watson walks the thousand acres of his ranch every day with his herd of yaks always nearby. They're an ox-like mammal with dark, long, and silky hair, a horse-like tail, and a full bushy mane. Owning them may be a way to make money, but he and his wife run this yak ranch for one reason. We do it more out of love. We don't have to make a living at it. Watson says the horned mammals are superior to their more common pasture mates. Yaks are more intelligent than cattle. Sorry cows, don't mean to demean you. The yaks can weigh anywhere from 500 to 1300 pounds, but Watson says they are gentle giants. They come running with their tails up and bucking and kicking. They're happy to see me, and so that helps. And I walk among them and call their names and scratch them. As Watson yeah. performs the tasks yeah. of a ranch owner, the yaks love to be shown attention. They're very gentle, and they're very they're completely domesticated. Watson says inheriting the ranch from his father-in-law, who owned the property for 50 years prior, allowed him to own a little piece of bliss. We like our neighborhood. We have our own little piece of paradise here. Restaurants and cafes around Calis spell on whitefish actually sell the yak meat. The ranch only harvests the ones with anger problems. Uh, we only eat the mean and ugly ones. And it is, unlike llamas and alpacas, it's um, socially acceptable to eat yaks. At the end of the day, they're just cows. You can visit the Raven in Lakeside or even hops in downtown Kalispell to try a taste of yak. In Kalispell, Jordan Johnson, MTN News. And if you think the Springbrook Ranch sounds familiar, you're right. It's also home to Carlos the Camel, who we profiled last month.